Well, hello everyone, it's Rose. And today I am getting back into doing a bunch of openings. Um, I have some more Peggy buys that I'll be opening today. Uh, but this one is a special shapes that I purchased from, uh, let's see, I got this one from Peggy buy, I believe, I think. No, I got this one from AliExpress, the Matreshka DIY Love Store. Okay, so let's get into it. It is very well wrapped. Uh, this one was uh, ordered on January 7th. It was shipped on January 9th and I received it on January 16th. I've been holding off on opening it because I wanted to do the opening for this at the same time as I did the opening for two other versions. Oh my God, I hope I have not just cut the dud. No, I haven't, okay, wow. Okay, so some of you will have seen me opening my um, uh, Japanese geisha, Japanese princess, I call her by different names depending on the day. And I accidentally, I was using a new knife, and I accidentally slightly cut the canvas. And so I decided I'm not using that knife to do openings anymore. Um, and I, I thought I had cut through the canvas with my scissors, and I thought maybe I'm just in a stage of my life where I have to cut through canvases. Maybe that's just where, you know, where my mental shape is at these days. I don't know. But no, that's not what happened. It was just uh, double layers of the wrapping. Okay. So this is, oh my goodness. It's taped to, so it's a bubble wrap package around more bubble wrap and I can already see the special diamonds. Oh, and a big, okay. All right, so I'm already liking what I see here. They, they packed it very, very well. I'm going to very carefully cut this bubble wrap off. Take your time, take your time. It'll still be there if it takes five minutes longer or 10 seconds longer. Now, I think this is the same one that I just last night watched Tanya from Diggy 415 open. So Tanya, while it was not true at the time, that I watched this last your video last night that uh, that I had received this yet. Now it is true. All right. So what did I get? I got um, a pink pen with uh, two of these cushy grips, which is really really nice. Uh, I got a boat. No bags, that's fine. With a little plate of wax, and that's that's good too. Okay, so I'll set that aside. Very pretty diamonds, very very pretty diamonds, and I'll look at those a little bit later. So the the um, diamond painting itself, ah, static. Okay, the diamond painting itself is wrapped in cellophane, which is sealed with scotch tape, well, whatever. I'm sure it might not be scotch brand, but it's, you know what I mean when I say scotch tape. And uh, there we go, okay. Oh, all right, so that scotch tape was on the plastic covering. So I'm hoping that I didn't tear the plastic covering. Oh my goodness, let's see. So what I'm gonna be doing 
uh, whether I tore it or not, is uh, not right now, but I will be replacing the plastic cover with, with um, parchment paper because especially with these loose ends here, I don't like that because that will tear right down into the painting. Okay. So this is a big one. This is a big one. Okay. Let's give you the details on this. So I forgot to mention while I was unboxing the cat tapestry that the canvas came rolled on this uh, thick foam roller, um, which I will use for my diamond painting pens, pink pens, as a cushion um, for my hands. Okay, so this is a 40 by 50 special shapes. I got it from, as I mentioned, AliExpress, the Matreshka DIY Love Store. I paid $14.16 for this. And looking at this canvas, there are a ton of diamonds that need to be placed. So $14.16, that's a really, really good price for this. Um, 40 by 50 centimeters. Now let's see if that is the canvas or the drill area. The drill area is 40 centimeters by 50 centimeters so um, I'm very happy with that this is this is the a very large special shapes um, it's gonna look really pretty and it's going to it's part of my series of cat tapestries this is actually the fifth one of the cat tapestries that I ordered um, and uh, when I have received them all, and I think by now I will have received them all, I have a pile of diamond paintings over in the corner there. Oh, Phoebe is looking out the window and sees something that aggravates her or excites her or whatever. Um, anyway, so this is one of the diamond paintings. Uh, I have, I think, two. I finished one. I got one in the Peggy by Hall that... Uh, was not special shapes. I think it was, I can't remember if it was square or round, but it was quite small and it's going to look absolutely dreadful. I know that, but I'm going to do it anyway. So I think what I'll do is after I finish the Japanese princess and the, um, the stained glass flower that I'm working on right now, I'm going to work on all of the cat tapestries so that I can finish all my cat tapestries and decide which ones I want to frame and decide if I want to buy any of them in larger sizes because I do want to have the whole set in large sizes. Okay, when I've opened the last of the cat tapestries, I'll show them all together and I'll put together a little playlist so that you can watch all of the openings for those uh, together. Um, I guess that's it. There were no other special notes that I made on this one. Okay, so uh, let us take a look at the diamonds. This is beautiful. I love this. I call it the peacock cat because it has peacock special shapes. Uh, in like in in the tail, no, not in the tail, but in the uh, in the body of the cat, there's these, these peacock special shapes. So let us take a peek at these special shapes and the regular diamonds. Um, first, I will show. Well, first, I'm going to pull back the pa the the plastic just to flatten out the canvas a wee little bit. It's in very good condition. They shift it really nicely. Okay. And I'll show you the legend and I'll show you the drill area so that you can see what it is that you'd be getting if you were to order this. I'm very, like, I'm so happy with this right now. Uh, I needed a bit of a pick-me-up today, um, and this 
And so I decided, nope, I'm not going to start with the Peggy Buy haul today because I decided I was going to do a few openings. I'm going to start with something else. And I'm so glad that the something else was this because it's lovely. It really is lovely. Okay. There we go. And now that plastic goes down so nice and smooth. But you see I've got little tag ends here and I'm worried that those will tear. Um, hang on, where's my garbage? There it is. All right. uh, I'm afraid that that will tear into the painting uh, as I paint, so I will replace that with uh, parchment, as I said. Uh, okay, so there is the canvas. Not sure if you can see it all upright like that. Let's let's see. You can see most of it. I'll just adjust the camera so that look at that. Oh my goodness, but that's beautiful. <gasps> it's even better looking through the camera. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Happy, happy, happy. Joy, joy, joy. Okay, let me show you the legend. So there's 14 different kinds of drills. And there is the canvas and the drill area. Exceptionally clear. You've got everything from the little teeny tiny drills here to the great big peacock and uh, the eye feather, the feather eyes, whatever you call them. So let's take a look at the package drills here. Got two bags of the clear silver rhinestones and then I guess let's see it's hard to tell through the camera what color that is um, it's like a red it's like a ruby ruby red very pretty and then the golden yellow more of the golden yellow and then this beautiful sapphire blue and then this emerald green. Oh, look at that. Just gorgeous. And then this purple. Oh my goodness, but this is beautiful. Now, I've never received these gold diamonds before. Drills, whatever. Um, but they look very rich. That looks nice. And more of those. And yet more of those. And then we've got, it looks like bigger um yeah they're bigger green gems uh sort of emerald green gems and then bigger these look like a b gems but they're the they're the yellow sort of the yeah the, the yellow that i saw earlier but bigger and then we've got the a b purple primary color here, which, again, they're all rhinestones, but they're different shapes, and these are iridescent. So isn't that lovely? I don't have 11. What's 11? Oh, okay. So 11 is empty. But look, here's 11. Look at that. Those are so, so pretty. And then we've got 12, which are these, you know, seedy type iridescent purple beads. And then we've got 13, which is the peacock eyes. Look at Oh my goodness. Okay, let's open this up and take a look at these without them being 
in the plastic. I never do this, but I'm doing it just for you. So look at the size of those. I'm going to hold up my measuring tape so that you can see how big these are. Look at that. Okay. Now Pippi got at my measuring tape. It, it's my fault because clearly I put it too close to something and one of the cats knocked it off the table because Pippi never gets anything off the table, but the cats sometimes knock things off. So uh, it no longer retracts, so I have to go back to Lee Valley and buy um, another one of these. Uh, okay, so let's see how long these are. So those are three centimeters long. Look at those, they're just gorgeous. So I'm gonna go to Michael's, I'm not sure if it's today or another day, and I'm gonna check out uh, different kinds of varnishes. I wanna get like a super high gloss varnish it's going to dry very, very clear uh, because the Tombow that I've been using has been good, but I want something that dries more like a varnish on a piece of wood. Um, but it can't be just plain varnish because it's going to uh, be yellow and I don't want it to diminish the shine of the diamonds. I also don't want sparkle because I don't want to add, um, you know, glitter. So anyway, oh, and there's there's number fourteen. So there are you know the silver silver rings. Um, let's see where the silver rings are. Oh, I'm looking for the silver rings. Hmm. And they're just round circles on the legend so where the heck would that be i don't know i guess i'll be surprised when i uh you're probably seeing them and saying there right there right there they're right there rose right there now i don't know okay um i don't know where they are uh, okay, so I have to say that this, for whatever, $14 and a few cents, $14.16 Canadian, which is like $10 American, um, this is a fabulous deal. Fabulous deal, and it makes me happy on a day when I woke up and I was feeling kind of, eh. This is a good thing. Um, it's a mood brightener for sure and I'm very much looking forward to doing it. There are a lot of diamonds on this. Okay, so that's it. That is um, Cat Tapestry number five, Peacock Cat, Special Diamonds Partial, 40 by 50, Matrushka DIY Love Store on AliExpress, I would give this one a great big humongous thumbs up. Uh, and if you agree, and if you like this video, why don't you give it a great big thumbs up. And um, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And also, leave me comments down below. Tell me what you think. Tell me if you've done this one. I see that a lot of people lately have been buying this one and, uh, and putting unboxing videos up. So I think it's quite popular right now. Um, and I can see why, because it is just beautiful. Like I love these details down in the corners here and up in the corners here. I love the, the idea of the frame. That is just gonna be beautiful. Just beautiful. Yep. Yep, very good. Okay, so thanks everybody. Uh, that's it for this video. I will be coming to you with many, many more videos in the days ahead. So come back and visit with me soon. Take care. Bye-bye.